Yeah, so here we have Mr. Pradeep Chakrabarti, who is the former director of the FSCI. So, Mr. Chakrabarti, it's a pleasure having to you here. So, uh, being in, uh, you know, how was your overall experience in the India Food Safety and Nutrition Summit and Awards ceremony? Yeah, I, I have attended a number of Indian uh, this this type of sum, uh, summit, and I was a speaker in all the summits. And uh, I, uh, I uh, read this summit as one of the best summit in India because I, I am a speaker not only in India but also abroad. And uh, the more uh, important thing actually what I want to mention that uh, our uh, um, attendees actually, the, those who attended this conference actually was so intent to learn and uh, they never left uh, even after lunch, uh, lunch break or uh, tea break. So that is the greatest thing. And uh, this panel actually full of experts and uh, they are well, well versed with the industry and the problems and the probable solutions also. And uh, people actually who attended this conference, I think uh, will definitely be benefited uh, from the interaction with the speakers and the, uh, from, from the panelists also. So I consider it wa is one of the best panel uh, panel panels uh, in uh, in the in the last uh, four or five conferences. Thank you, Mr. Chagravati. That was great. So, uh, would you like to share your thoughts on the current opportunities and the challenges in the Indian market? Since, uh, since this uh, conference is on the Indian Food Safety uh, Summit and Nutrition. Uh, so nutrition actually nowadays has gained very much importance, particularly uh, after this COVID-19 uh, pandemic. And uh, we all know that uh, immunity is, is a great concern uh, during this COVID-19 and people are uh, more uh, aware, more aware of the their health and other health related diseases and uh, this nutraceutical industry is playing a vital role and we know, we all know that this nutraceutical industry is uh, increasing at a very uh, stupendous growth and uh, government of india particularly niti ayog actually they estimated this industry to grow uh, from uh, current 8 billion dollars to uh, 8 billion us dollars to 100 billion us dollars by 2030 so our industry uh, as well as uh, the uh, population uh, also uh, should take advantage of this uh, the, it is increasing because the people are um, more co are consuming more and more nutraceutical products for uh, general uh, which helps in uh, well being of uh, well being of uh, uh, of our health actually and uh, immunity and other health related diseases particularly we know that obesity is a very big problem and uh, uh, health related uh, brain functions and other things also are getting uh, importance to the population and people are uh, taking uh, con consuming uh, nutraceutical products uh, almost as a part of the daily diet so the, uh, this industry is growing and will grow at a very stupendous and india will play a vital role by 2030 Thank you, Mr. Pradeep. That was uh, very uh, great. So, what would you like to say on your experience with uh, Cynex? Cynex actually is a very, uh, they have organized this conference in such a nice way and uh, they have, uh, there are, uh, there were as many as eight panels and uh, though I was, I was a speaker in uh, panel two, but uh, I was uh, forced to listen to all the other panel members because uh, it will uh, keep one updated with the current scenario. Uh, of Indian industry as well as uh, they are concerned with the regulators and other uh, various problems. So Sinex has organized it very nicely and they have covered almost all topics of uh, food and nutrition in the uh, industry. And uh, I think uh, this is one of the, I have attended a number of, uh, uh, number of conferences at, organized by Sinex, but I think this conference is the best. Thank you Pradeep ji, it was uh, honorable to having you.